Paul Newman's stainless steel Rolex has shattered the world record for a wristwatch sold at auction when it fetched $17.8 million at Phillips in New York in October. The iconic timepiece is just one of many standout sales in 2017. We take a look at the most impressive record breakers of the year. Starting the year off right, a super rare 1963 E-Type Jaguar came up for auction in January at a Bonham sale in Scottsdale, Arizona and sold for $7.3 million, making it the world's most expensive E-Type, and then some. Setting a record for the highest price ever paid for a calf at auction in Australia, a prized Holstein Heifer, which was bred by Lighted Genetics went under the hammer at an auction in Tatra, Victoria in January and realized a meaty $193,000. Sotheby's London held the world's most lucrative auction of erotic art in February, which ended up grossing a record $7 million. Unsurprisingly, the NSFW auction catalog almost crashed the Sotheby's website after attracting a record-breaking 1 million views. This antique silver bowl is one of the tamer pieces from the sale. Later that month, Christie's in London sold Rene Magritte's La Corde Sensible, 1960, for $18.9 million, a new record for the surrealist artist. The auction house's Art of the Surreal sale also featured Magritte's Le Domaine Darnheim, 1938, which fetched $12.5 million. On March 1, a 1905 painting of flowers in a garden by Gustav Klimt entitled Bauer and Garten, Bloom and Garten, went for $63 million at a Sotheby's auction in London. Surpassing all expectations, the sale smashed the record for any work by the Austrian artist. Obliterating the record for the most valuable collection of American coins ever sold, the D. Brandt Poe collection grossed a not too shabby $106.7 million. The collection, which includes this rare 1,804 silver dollar sold for $3 million, was auctioned off at Stax Bowers Galleries in Santa Ana, California. The Abbey Road console used to record Pink Floyd's classic The Dark Side of the Moon album in the early 1970s sold for a sensational $1.8 million at a Bonhams auction in New York in March, breaking several records, including the highest price achieved for a piece of audio tech. One of this year's most standout sales, the breathtaking Pink Star Diamond brought the auction house down in April when it sold for a record $71.2 million at Sotheby's Hong Kong. The 59.60 carat rock, which was acquired by jeweler Chow Tai Fook, is the most expensive gem ever sold at auction. This exquisite late 16th to early 17th century ottoman panel in sumptuous silk and metal thread fetched an impressive $1.4 million at a Sotheby's London auction on April 28. The realized price is a new record for an antique ottoman textile. In May, this untitled 1982 picture of a skull by neo-expressionist graffiti artist Jean-Michel Basquiat went under the hammer at Sotheby's New York and was snapped up by Japanese internet entrepreneur Yusai Kamazawa for $110.5 million, making it the most expensive painting by an American artist ever sold at auction, in 2017's priciest lot. The most expensive earrings ever sold at auction. This mismatched pair of fancy colored diamond earrings dubbed Apollo and Artemis realized an eye-watering $57.4 million at a Sotheby's Geneva sale in mid-May. Another record was broken in May, when this bronze sculpture, which was cast in 1913 by Constantin Brancusi, went under the hammer for $57.4 million at a Christie's auction in London, the highest price ever realized for a work by the artist. The record for the most expensive handbag ever sold at auction was smashed in May at Christie's Hong Kong when this blingy Hermes Birkin Himalaya handbag sold for $379,261. Crafted from crocodile skin, the ultra-premium bag is encrusted with 205 diamonds and features 18 karat gold buckles. Worn by Michael Jordan at the 1984 Summer Olympics in Los Angeles, this battered pair of sneakers fetched $190,373 at an SCP auction in Arizona back in June, a world record for athlete-worn footwear. 
the record price realized for a Kandinsky artwork at auction was broken twice in one night in June when the Russian artist's 1903 painting Landscape with Greenhouse sold for $27.7 million at Sotheby's London, swiftly followed by Painting with White Lines from 1913, which fetched $43 million. Also in June, the famed 18.04 carat Rockefeller Emerald was auctioned by Christie's New York, realizing a record-shattering $5.5 million. This makes the Emerald, which was bought by jeweler Harry Winston, the most expensive ever in terms of price per carat. Yet another artist record was broken in June, Max Beckman's powerful 1938 painting Bird's Hell which depicts the horrors of pre-World War II Germany, sold for $42 million at a Christie's auction in London, the highest price realized for a work by the artist. The holy grail for Star Wars fans, the real deal or 2D2 prop used in the original film trilogy netted a cool $2.8 million at a Profiles in History sale in California in June, the highest price ever achieved for a movie prop at auction. At the beginning of July, a collection of rare Disney animation art from a variety of classic, much-loved movies came up for auction in Dallas. The Heritage Sale, which included this artwork from Fantasia by Kay Nielsen, grossed $1.4 million, a record for an animation art sale. A new world record for a Chinese antique art piece. This highly prized 1,000-year-old bronze plate went for an astronomical $27.3 million at a Zilling Yunch auction in Hangzhou, eastern China on July 15. In August, two car sales were the highlights of the month. In the first sale, a Bonhams auction in Carmel, California, this rare 1995 McLaren F1 sold for $15.6 million, a record price for a McLaren hypercar. Hot on its heels, this rare 1956 Aston Martin DBR1 fetched a jaw-dropping $22.5 million at a Sotheby's auction in Monterey, California, making it the most expensive Aston Martin and the priciest ever British-made car sold at auction. In September, the record auction price for a brand new car was shattered by this Ferrari La Ferrari Aperta. The stunning hypercar, which hasn't even been built yet sold for $9.6 million at a charity auction in Italy. Later in September, Audrey Hepburn's actual breakfast at Tiffany's script, complete with the actress's handwritten notes, fetched $834,000 at a Christie's sale in London, a record-breaking sum for a film script sold at auction. In October, the record price realized at auction for a Chinese antique art piece which was said by the bronze plate in July, was smashed when this incredibly rare but rather plain-looking 1,000-year-old porcelain bowl sold for $37.7 million at a Sotheby's auction in Hong Kong, 